Miley Cyrus's new song Flowers has caused chaos. The track has multiple references to her ex-husband Liam Hemsworth, but the song also features a nod to another famous star. Let's find out who this star is and what is going on between him and Miley Cyrus. Stay tuned to find out more. The chorus of Miley Cyrus's new song samples Bruno Mars's 2012 hit song When I Was Your Man, which Liam Hemsworth had also dedicated to her ex-wife. The original song is about regret after losing a romantic partner and features lyrics which include I should've bought you flowers and held your hand, should've gave you all my hours when I had a chance, take you to every party cause all you wanted to do was dance. By flipping the lyrics, Miley sings I can take myself dancing and I can hold my own hand, yeah I can love me better than you can. I can take myself dancing refers to a famous red carpet moment when Liam was not liking Miley's twerking incident. As fans drew similarities between flowers and when I was your man, many people are wondering whether Miley Cyrus and Bruno Mars ever dated or got married. The singer and former Disney actress released her new song Flowers, and it will also be included in her upcoming album Endless Summer Vacation. As the song made waves across streaming platforms, many fans found similarities in the lyrics of Flowers and Bruno Mars's 2010 track When I Was Your Man. Well, Miley Cyrus and Bruno Mars were never married. On public understanding, they both haven't been in a romantic relationship. While being recording artists from the same industry, they have attended a lot of award events and made multiple public appearances at similar venues. For instance, they both attended the 60th Annual Grammy Awards, which took place in New York City on January 28, 2018. Miley sat behind a locked out of heaven singer and posed for a picture in front of the cameras. Miley was married to Liam Hemsworth. The musician was in a 10 year on and off relationship with the Australian actor after they met each other on the set of the movie The Last Song. After an on and off romance for a couple of years, Liam and Miley got engaged in 2012. They delayed their wedding in 2013 and called it off later in the same year. In 2016, they got engaged for the second time after pacifying their romance. At that time, Miley hinted about her engagement with a picture on Instagram. They got married in 2018 and confirmed their divorce in 2019. The couple have not addressed the genuine reasons behind their divorce. Before we move ahead, if you're liking this content so far, please consider subscribing and liking this video. Now let's continue. While some fans were disturbed over Miley's previous relationship, others have compared the lyrics of her single Flowers and Bruno's song When I Was Your Man. In Bruno's song, the lyrics hint at heartbreak after the split of his then girlfriend Jessica Kiban. Meanwhile, Flowers has a bigger focus on self love, where the Disney star sings I can buy myself flowers, write my name in the sand, talk to myself for hours, say things you don't understand. I can take myself dancing and I can hold my own hand. Yeah, I can love me better than you can. A TikTok user made a stitch of Miley and Bruno's song which explains the huge social media attention surrounding these two tracks. In the comments, one user said, I knew it sounded like another song. Another one tweeted, How come this new Miley Cyrus song Flowers sounds so familiar? Do you think it sounds like this song from Bruno Mars when I was your man? From Nick Jonas to Liam Hemsworth and everyone in between, Miley Cyrus has also had a great time of having a loved one. Cody Simpson and Miley Cyrus were also an example of a strong flame of passion burning out too quickly. They started dating in 2019, right when Simpson transitioned back into swim training and right before the pandemic. They both lived together before he had to return to Australia, and Miley got ready for a tour, but they both parted their ways. Simpson spoke to Billboard about their breakup and claimed that there were no hard feelings. They were just going to different places. Bruno Mars and his girlfriend Jessica Caban have also been together from 2011 and will also stay together in 2023. They both prefer keeping their relationship private and out of the public eye. In this way, they can both focus on their professional careers within the entertainment industry. The couple lives together in a $6.5 million mansion in Los Angeles. Throughout their 10 years of dating, Bruno Mars and Jessica Caban have proven that they can get through any hurdle, from showing never-ending love and support from both of their careers to going to as many award shows together. Bruno has also written various heartfelt songs dedicated to Jessica and the battles that come with being in a relationship. The couple has even proven that they can work together on projects and still be as strong as ever. 
hopefully, with a new album to come from Bruno Mars's band Silk Sonic, a Jessica cameo comes from it. Whether she features in a music video or uses her line in the video, we are sure it will be great. Bruno Mars and Jessica Coban are an authorized power couple and a force to be reckoned with, and fans surely cannot get enough of them.